And the hedgehog concept was uh, created by um, Jim Collins in his amazing books, uh, Good to Great and Built to Last. So we have a look at the diagram of a hedgehog. I mean, you know what a hedgehog is, it's a porcupine. Basically, and when it's in danger, it curls up into a ball with its spikes on the outside, and that way it can stop any natural predators getting to it. And what you've got to do is work out what you do naturally, so you're brilliant at doing it, and what you what you want to do forever. So there's three elements that go into this, uh, this Venn diagram. First one is what are you potentially the best in the world at doing? So you can turn around with good bragging rights and say, leave it to me, I'll take care of it. The next thing is uh, what are you actually passionate about, so you love doing it, and you'd never get bored. And the third thing is what will the world pay for? Not what does the world need, but what does the world want? What will it pay for? And somewhere between those three circles, what you're brilliant at, what you love, and what people will pay for is your own personal hedgehog. And when you do that, it means you're in your zone all the time. So the imposter syndrome will only be when you take that hedgehog to a new place. But when you arrive, you're on a roll because you're already doing what you do really well. And that's a really powerful way to start driving the rest of your business. And it never gets taught at school. And I think that everybody should know it. Now, here's the thing that I found really powerful. And we're going to mention this amongst other techniques. Vision boards are great because ultimately they're creating goals. But what's more powerful than goals is to learn business models of how to reverse engineer those levels of success. Yeah. So rather than tr saying one day I want to live in this house, I want to drive that car, I'd love to go on holiday here, work out if you go there, what is the business model you have to adopt to be able to make that happen and just make your vision board full of business models. That way you can have those things really whenever you want them. I guess it comes down to a simple choice, really. Get busy living, or get busy dying.